Ah, they almost got me. They almost got me. They almost got me. I almost fell for this. I almost fell for it. You know, I said at first, after the arbitration, Judge Weinstein's ruling, saying um, Fury and Wilder got a fight for a third time, July 24th. I was like, nah, I'm not having it. That's some crap. This whole thing is contrived. They, you know, they weren't going to fight AJ in the first place. This, that, and the third. I'm like, I'm not supporting this fight. I ain't buying it. <laughs> but then, fast forward a couple of days, a couple of weeks later, they're announcing a, a juicy undercard. Stacked. That thing was stacked. I'm like, mm, I do enjoy a bit of boxing. I do like boxing. So, mm, why not? I want to see a Jaguar fight. I want to see a Jaguar Frank Sanchez. That's a good fight. That's a great fight. I've been waiting for the Kovnaski Hellenius fight for a while. I want to see that. I want to see that. Jared Anderson, I told you guys before, I, I love Jared Anderson. I think it's a great fight. I think it's got a bright future. So I'm like, you know what? Yeah, I'm going to buy the pay-per-view. I'm going to buy the pay-per-view. <laughs> I'm going to buy the pay-per-view. I was going to pay for the Fury while the pay-per-view. I was going to buy it. I can't support these guys. I can't support this. I <laughs> can't support this i was willing to pull all of that to the side put um fury's shady history to the side and say you know what Let, let's just go with it well obviously you can't trust these guys both teams put together is just a recipe for disaster team fury and um team pbc team wilder is just a marriage made in hell so nah i cannot this in particular this whole this whole marriage I can't do this. I can't do it. When they got together, the plan was gain some leverage on AJ to try A-side him and repeatedly fight for this one belt over and over and over again. Guessing the end goal was to be bigger than AJ or, or as big as AJ. How many years later? What, four years later? Three years later? We're still here. Still waiting for that. We we'll pretend like we want to fight AJ and then we mark our fights over this one belt and see if we can... See if we can make some some profit. And it's been flopping and flopping and flopping. And it appears like it was about to flop again. According to some people, it might have been about to flop again. So, COVID. Fury's old camp's been infiltrated with COVID. Everybody's got COVID. Fury's got COVID. Sugar Hill's got COVID. Um, who's got COVID? Sparring partner's got COVID. His brother Tommy's got it. Isaac Lowe's got it. Everybody's got it. Well, that's one reason people's been saying the fight's been called off anyway. It's due to poor sales. Another reason being... Apparently, if you got pause put on him by Jared Anderson in the gym, I'm not sure how that's how that's possible. I, I swear you can't hit Fury. I, I thought people said you can't hit Fury, and Fury don't get. <laughs> yeah, apparently got beat up by Jared Anderson in the gym, innit? I'm I'm not making this up. I ain't making it up. It's all out there. It's all out there. Look all over. Do a, do a quick Google. It's all out there. Apparently, Fury got beat up by Jared Anderson in the gym. The word is actually. Tyson Fury got stopped on his feet by Jared Anderson. He got stopped on his feet. Anderson and Fury, they're both signed to top rank. So that's one reason why this news might be kept a little hush. Anderson might not come out right and say, yeah, I did stop the guy. He might, maybe years down the line, he might reveal it. But I don't think he's going to talk about it anytime soon. And that's why they've decided to catch COVID. Fights off. Deontay Wilder is probably going to get excited by this news like yes if Anderson can do it I can do it too but the, the thing is Anderson is better than Wilder so Wilder this has nothing to do with you by the way this is Jared Anderson's work I, I, I can just I can predict Wilder's going to come out talking crazy like he did it just like when um, Andrew Ruiz beat AJ he was, he was talking all sorts of stuff so watch look out for the Wilder interviews talking crazy about Jared Anderson and Fury like he knocked out Fury in sparring. To be, to be honest with you, yeah, I don't, I don't really want to dwell too much in this. I'm, I'm, I'm over these guys. I'm over their fight. I watch it. I watch their fight, but to be honest, yeah, f these man. As usual, thoughts in the comment section. Subscribe if you're new around here. Drop that like on your way out too. Have the notification bell so you know exactly what's popping over here. Twelve question marks UK. I'm out.